We are making smothered pork chops today with no mushrooms. So this was the best price I could find on pork. This is a pork tenderloin and it was $3.43 a pound. And this is 1.8 pounds. So I'm going to just about half it, just like that. And I'm just gonna take this half out. And I'm gonna do like medallions, I guess then. Just slice it like this. And so see the pieces I'm coming up with? Those are nice little chunks of, of uh, pork. I try to make these recipes as budget friendly and as easy as possible. To the cream of potato, we're gonna add one fourth cup water. Now we're gonna add our spices. We're doing a half a teaspoon of garlic. A half a teaspoon of black pepper. teaspoon of crushed rosemary. Great flavor. Rosemary gives you great flavor. And then a half a teaspoon of ground mustard that I'm almost out of. teaspoon of salt. Don't over salt this. You can always salt when you're eating, right? And then one fourth teaspoon of cumin. I know what you're thinking, but it's really good. And let's stir that up. Okay, we're going to add our pork pieces. This has ended up being 13 ounces of pork. Probably don't need to put that much in there. Um, but I know there's some guys out there that like to eat, and so that'll give you plenty of pork. And so when this is done, then we are gonna serve this over rice. Or you could serve it over spaghetti squash um, if you're doing low carb. Um, very versatile what you do with this. Um, you can serve it over mashed potatoes. To this, we're adding a half a cup of green frozen green beans. I thought a third would be enough, but I, I want to put it up to a half. Okay, I decided to add a diced carrot. Mix it up really well. That looks delicious. And let's put the lid on and let's let it cook for five hours on high. Five hours on high, okay? And then we'll see what it, how yummy it looks. Okay, look how beautiful that is. You have some of your carrots, some of the potatoes from the potato uh, soup, cream of soup, your pork medallions, and your green beans. And I put a few sliced fresh tomatoes and a few uh, green onions from our garden. And so let's see what this tastes like. Let's get a little bit. And then just a little piece of meat. So I got some. Carrots, rice, meat. Mmm. That is wonderful. You gotta try this recipe. Take care. See you next time. Bye. Mmm, 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 mmm.